You laid out the rules of poetry before me. You taught me how to stand up straight and pull out my big girl voice in order to wow an audience. You showed me how to carefully weave metaphors and properly bounce my words so that my rants would sound pretty and my weeds look like roses. I followed your every tip, feet firmly planted, eyes on the audience, and don't let your hands shake. But that wasn't enough. It isn't enough, you said, to look like a rose. You have to be a rose, so write about something important. Huge, significant things like politics and religion, Donald Trump and almighty God, write about roses. But there's already so much bicker and banter on these dreadful subjects. Too many poems that start with roses are red, violets are blue, but weeds are yellow, white, and purple too. And I want to write about weeds. Weeds that children gather up in bunches and that I always step over because I can't step on such pretty things. Weeds my father never picks and instead lets grow like the wilderness of my mind and soul. And I want to write about that too. Stories of my life and the men who walked in and out of it, rising and setting like the sun, the first kiss, the first love, the first time I laid bare before a man and let the secrets of my skin spill into his angry, lustful eyes. The words he said when he saw the even lines that decorated my skin, he said, baby, don't you worry, I like broken girls, cause some girls are made for loving and others for fucking, and guess which one you are, sweetheart? And I guess correctly, I let him convince me my body was a temple dedicated to his pleasure, and I believed him when he said my scars look pretty. And let's talk about the scars, the first and the second, because they each have their stories. Let's talk about how I started, and how I stopped, and how I started, and how I stopped, and how I started, and finally, finally, stopped. Let's talk about the cracks I tried to patch out, but they finally caught up. Let's talk about the mommy, mommy, take me to the doctor, I can't see in all this darkness. Let's talk about the weeds. Weeds that children gather up in bunches and I could never step on because I can't step on something I relate to so much. Weeds my father let grow what other men stepped on. Flowers I picked and laid over corpses. Flowers you never thought were important. Because while you taught me how to look like a rose, you never taught me how to feel like a rose. You taught me how to please an audience but not myself. But I am done following rules. I'll slouch and I'll whisper and mix up my metaphors and never rhyme again because I am not an instrument of pleasure. My body is not a temple. My hands do more than blow kisses. They write secrets that make grown men cry because secrets aren't always pretty. They can be annoying like weeds. But you don't tell me what my poetry should be.